Magnus Chester. So they are off. The girls under 11, the first leg. As and there's the start of your that, girls that, that, that under 11 so for my 80 meter relay. Over. Looks like Dubois out front. And good handing over. Dubois is off. Exchange is being made there. And this is a good start. They're followed by the number nine. We have Bookerman on the outside there in there lane seven. Is. Dubois, good handover once again. Here but now comes the what looks like the Kingstown well. prep. This is going to be interesting. We have to wait until at least from this vantage point. The it's prep school. Prep school, prep school just on the inside away, of CW Prescott. Exchange is made. It's Kingstown Prep. So. CW prep Prescott, Stephanie away. Brown, Kingstown Government. And Kingstown Prep. Stephanie Kingstown. Brown still coming through. Stephanie Brown, Prep School. Stephanie Brown, Prep School. But Prep School, Dubois seems to uh, come through. And that's the start of the girls' intermediate as they come down the middle here. Let's see what's happening in the middle. It's a tough one here, but let's see what's going to happen at the finish line. It is pretty. And there they go. And Davis is out very quickly here. It's a bit of a challenge. It's a bit of a challenge here as they come to the finish line. But Cleo finishes first. There enough. goes the, the gun. And they're off for the first leg of this 4 by 200 meters. As they come around the curve, Union Island is there. So to his girls' high school, Barley Secondary School. That's the Bethel High, Bookerman Bay Secondary, rather. As they come inside the street for the first handover. And uh, girls' high school off. So to his Georgetown, Barley. That's girls' high school stretching her way around. Georgetown in the mix. So too is Barley. Union Island is in there and fourth. As they race for the third handover. Girls High School still maintaining the lead. And off they go. It's George, it's Girls High School. I think that's the second handover. And Georgetown in second. Barley third. Union Island is there. But Girls High School is striding well, extending the lead. Georgetown coming through second. It's Girls High School. Georgetown closing the gap. And there goes the handover. It's Girls High School in the final straight. It's Girls High School with a decent lead as she comes around the bend. Georgetown is powering her way through. The hit for the home stretch. It's girls high school. This is going to be a girls high school race. Georgetown is coming through. Barley is fighting through for, for, for second. Jadel Girls high Those are just some of the names that just quickly jump out at you. And there they all go. They're off. Coming around that curve at the northern end. It's a good blistering pace as they turn. Around that bend, the race is off. Petty Badel is there. Grammar School, Union Island, Grammar School, Petty Badel. And they're off on the first 100 meters. This is 800 meters, two laps. They are going along. Again, we look at the pace of the boys a, a bit quicker than, than, than the girls. But. There is hit on the eastern side, and you can see the Barley athletes already out front. George is there, so too is St. Martin. Petty Badel is there, Chomoka is there, and bringing up the rear is the Grammar School. So this would be pretty interesting as Georgetown now looking to move to, into the leadership position as they come around the bend. And there goes the bell for the final leg, signal of the final leg. George Tong still in there. He's going along rather nicely. So too the Barley athletes, both going neck and neck. It's George Tong. Barley with two in second and third position. Petty Bedell is in fourth. St. Martin fifth. Trumoka sixth. Grammar School in the seller position. George Tong looking to extend the lead as they go around the eastern side 
he's striding along rather nicely can he maintain this momentum he's going he's looking back looking to see the gap between himself and the Barley students as he turns around the final curb looking for the home stretch he's striding away he's going to be it would be very difficult to beat him here as he goes around the bend for the final time looking into the home stretch he's striding away there is George Stong running away with it better uh, barely in second and third position here is Peter Bedell looking to make a move to hit a third position Thomas um, there is and I one would anticipate this would be uh, a pretty fast pace as well George Stong already making the mark on that eastern side but can they maintain this pace but again he has the curve those on the inner lane will, 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 will catch up as George Stong still striding away as he hits the curve on the northern end as they come into that final hundred meters for this the 400 leg first 400 it's still George Stong grammar school is there Still Georgetown Grammar School, Grammar School, and Pe here is Chumok Ontario coming through. I think here you can see Georgetown just running out of steam. Grammar School now in first position as they start the, the second leg, heading for the second changeover. They'll go around the southern bend still. No, it's St. Martin. Union Island is there. Grammar School is it with it. This is good. Union Island nips ahead. St. Martin is there. Grammar School is also there. And Union Island has St. Martin's to contend with. Chomoka is there. Barley in that fourth position. Grammar School in fifth. But it's Union Island with the lead. So Union Islands striding away beautifully, long legs. St. Martin's is there. Not Union, St. Martin. And Union Island and St. Martin. The blue tops. Say Union Island. Striding around that curve. They are known to have a lot of stamina. And he's really powering around. So he's really motoring all along. Grammar school coming through. St. Martin's in a beaten third. It's Union Island. Grammar school. St. Martin seemed to be beaten. Union Island. As he hit the home stretch for the third changeover. Grammar School. Barrel is there. St. Martin. Tromoka. Drummer School nips the lead. Would hand over the baton first. In fact, it finishes. Union.